In normal times, Red Sox lefty Rich Hill would spend most of February and March getting pulled, pushed, rubbed, and stretched at spring training. But the lockout had him on the lookout for another place to work out, and he found champion physical therapy in Waltham, not far from home. One of the you know, positive sides of it is being home with our 10-year-old son Bryce and my, my wife Caitlin and being able to enjoy our, our family time together. I think that's you know, the silver lining in a lot of this. Well, as you can see, Rich can keep himself in shape and do all the throwing he needs to in order to be ready for what is sure to be a shortened spring training if and when that ever happens. I think that the one thing that is disheartening to hear is that when you hear ownership not care about missing games because it's not profitable uh, in the early months of the season because, you know, the, the gate isn't there. Eight days shy of his 42nd birthday, Rich Hill is in this uphill battle, not so much for himself, but for kids half his age. You know, we're going to lose a lot, but we're fighting for a lot more as well. And I think that the players that came before us, um, you know, in 94, that, that sacrificed so much, we're in the same, uh, you know, or in a similar situation where we have to be, um, you know, kind of aware of, of the players that are coming next. And Rich also says the players may not get everything they want, but they should get what they deserve. Bob Haller in WCVB Sports Center 5.